Hey, what's up, guys? Nintendo Jin here. Welcome back to some more. Sorry. Welcome back to some more new Super Bros. DS. In the last episode, we completed uh, the final half of World One, which we 100% did. And in this episode, we are going to be taking on the first half, or 50% in World Two. So, without further ado, I mean. If you haven't already, please be sure to comment, like, subscribe. Hope so, Tim means a lot to me. All your support is greatly appreciated. New videos every day. But, anyways, without further ado, let's get into World 2 1. So, yeah. Now that we're in the desert, World 2 is the desert, so. Yeah. We're gonna have a fun time, maybe? But the music in World 2, the overworld theme, is actually pretty good. I'll let you guys listen to it. Okay. So you can tell I like it. <laughs> Obviously. Alright, that's a really good song. Correct. So yeah. Correct. Anyways, these are pokies, uh, they will only die immediately if you hit them at the top, but they will continue to drop down to, they will continue to fall down until you hit their head, and yeah, their head is basically their weakness, so die or not. But yeah, anyways, that is an easy course. That's okay. But yeah, there we go. Mario clear. Alright, now on to the second course of World 2. World 2 1. Also, we're going to call this World. Um, windy Sands. Because you can see the wind and there's a lot of sand. Yeah, we're gonna call this world the Windy Sands. Not very creative, creative, but it's something. And now we have the World One Overworld theme. What is up with this? Whatever. Now here we have Lack Two. We'll throw Spinies until you kill him, which is kind of annoying because he keeps moving. Oh man. Um. Yes, we missed the first Star Coin. Don't tell me. We need lack two to get it. Alright. Yeah, I'm right. Okay, so. I'm gonna have to try to get lack two. Cooperate with me. Thank you. And there we go. And the first one should be somewhere up here, I believe. Yeah, there we go. Right there. There's the first one. And then the third one, I believe, is in a pipe you need the cloud to get to and hopefully it doesn't start vanishing because that's right when I see that. Perfect. There's a checkpoint at least. Alright, come back please. I need you. Cooperate with me, Lack 2. Oh god. Whatever. Three times getting hit by enemies is worth it for a star coin. Am I right? No, I'm never right. I can't at what? Okay, so we have to go through a green pipe, which is somewhere over here. Please don't start vanishing, Cloud. Seriously. Okay, I'm actually kind of annoyed right now. Okay, how am I gonna do this? Cooperate with me, man. And of course he vanishes. Ah, come back. Hello? There you are. Let's go back here. Please. No! I'm gonna die. Just watch. Seriously? <sighs> One sec. 
Okay, I'm back. I died like two times, but now we got the cloud and we can go in the pipe. Is there even a pipe up here or am I wrong? Come. Maybe it's on this side. There we go. That was easy. No pipe. Nope. Where is the second star coin, man? I can't believe I cannot find it. It's actually so annoying. Like. Maybe it's further ahead in the course. I'm stupid. I'm really stupid. Alright, sorry about that guys. Spent like so many so much time wasted just trying to find an easy star coin. I thought there was a pipe I had to go into, but maybe not. One up. There we go. At least I got live back. But yeah, anyways, that is world 2-1. World 2-2. Finally got that done, and now, and now we are gonna be going to world two dash three. So, yeah, this might be a long video because there are, I think, two secret exits we have to get. Okay, I know this course. Okay. You ground pound on those to get through and loot things. Yeah. Oh crap. And there we go. Alright, now for the third star coin, it's, you have to hit the switch right here, do that, and you have to swim up here, and for the secret exit, um, you have to hit the switch again, actually I think the secret exit and the third star coin are combined together, are you serious, come on, yeah, the third star coin and the secret exit are combined together, so, Hit the switch, don't fail like I did, because I suck. And then you have to swim up here, and hurry up so you can hit the switch. And then swim up here, and then yeah. Or not, the third star coin is thir further up ahead. This is where the secret exit is, so... Now we're uh, just going to do that. Nope. 4,000. Anyways, I'll meet you guys back when we get to the next area. So see you guys in a bit. In a flash. Alright guys, we're back. Hit the switch. And swim over to this side. <coughs> Real easy. And there we go. Now for the third star coin. You go up here. I'm on the right track, right? Oh my. Okay, use that. Fire. Oh, okay. So here's what you gotta do you have to have running. You have to run just like this. And there we go. There's the third star coin. And now for the main exit. This go 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 
Uh, there we go. And then, there we go. We just 100%ed the course. I don't know if I can get a gold flag, that would be even. There we go. 2,000! That's even worse than 4,000. Ah, whatever. I found one up in the course off screen, so that's good. So now we're going to go on to this course, which has a mysterious red question block, World 2-4. And yeah. And these switches make big camel humps appear, so that's a new feature. Or you can be a noob and just call them hills. I'm sorry if anyone actually does call them hills. They're actually camel humps, but um, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to say that. I didn't mean to say they're hills and hills are things that noobs call in this game. I'm so sorry. I'm just being dramatic. Anyways, that, you don't need a mini mushroom for the second star coin. First of all, this course didn't even have a secret exit, so you don't have to worry about that. Uh, second of all, second star, star coin is under here. The mini pipe is actually a bonus room or something like that. I'm not sure, but yeah, something like that. Is on the red pipe, and and here it is. What? What? Do I actually need the mini mushroom? Oh crap! Mario's chilling. Look at him. Uh -huh. What's that? Second star coin. Okay, never mind. Oh wow, that fireball! A fireball! That fireball went really high. Jeez. Okay. Die! Killed both of you with two fireballs in one go. Awesome. Uh. Oh wow! Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Oh, one up! Nice! I didn't expect to get a one up, but now we have twelve lives. I know not nothing to brag about. Some people probably have way more than me. Twelve lives is just the average at the beginning. But whatever. I don't know. Anyways, now we're gonna do the secret level of world two. I believe there's nope. No other secret levels. We're gonna do world two A, which I believe is probably gonna be a no, it's not a water level. Stage appeared above water, but it's not water level. However, there is water in it and this stupid fish, so we have that to deal with. And I killed him with my fireball. Yeah, you can kill him with a star and a fireball. I believe those are the only two attacks you can use to kill him, but other than that, he's very annoying. Trust me, I've been there. I've died by him many times back in the day. I was by him there. And this course is Star Coins isn't that hard either. I believe that has a secret exit too. Actually, never mind. I'm thinking of something else. But this is the World 3 Overworld theme, so. Uh. Dude, excuse me? Do you mind? Fire Mario, it's been 14 minutes. Wow, guys, this is a long video. Or, I didn't mean to press that. Oh my god! See what I mean? This fish screws you over. Be careful now. And third star. The third star coin, you have to keep spinning and jump on that cube if you get up here. If you're not spinning while you jump on it, then it won't be very effective and you won't make it. Anywho, if you do uh, use a spin top and uh, press down on the Koopa, and you'll get a big boost, and you'll get the secret exit. I forgot this course had a secret exit, and I 
thing I was thinking right. Because um, that pipe, I thought it led to a secret exit, but I'm like, nah, it just leads to a star coin. And then I realized the red pipe, and then, yeah, it's a secret exit. So we're just going to go back in the course to unlock this pipe and get the main exit. So I'll see you guys in a flash. Alright guys, we're back. Went through the green pipe we saw earlier when we took the yellow pipe, which led to the secret exit. Now we are here, coming out of the green pipe, flying through the air, jumping on paratroopers, and getting a 1-up at the top. Or a 2,000, because I suck. But anyways, that is the main exit, the proper exit you are supposed to clear this course, but instead we got the secret one first, which is usually what I do if two courses have two exits, or one course, sorry. And this pipe leads to World 2 Dash Castle, as you can see, which we are not going to be doing. I could do it, but I'm not stupid and I'm not going to do that. But, you know, whatever. Anywho, we're finally getting to World 2 Dash Tower, the final course of this episode. It's been 16 minutes and 17 seconds. That changed in like one second, but you know, it's a pretty long video for my average. My average is six, um, 15 videos, but usually it's probably 10 or 10 and 15 is my average for like my videos or my let's play videos at least. But yeah, we're above the limit right now, and that's not good. I don't know, do you guys like long episodes? I know I asked this before in my um, past Let's Plays, but I don't know, do you guys like long Let's Plays? I mean, pff, long videos, like, when I mean long, I mean videos longer than like 15 minutes, or do you guys just like short and quick videos, 15 or below, I don't know. If I'm relaxing, then I prefer long videos. If I'm just trying to watch daily updates from my favorite YouTuber, then it's probably a quick video. But who cares? I mean, who knows? Or whatever. Anyways, I believe this is actually the second star coin. Yes, it is. I can tell. We missed the first one. I'll have to go back to Yeah! <sighs> that happened. <sighs> So jump on those platforms to this platform and then get on here. Drops. Go here. And this door leads to. Yeah, that's the second star coin. This door leads to. Ah, we're almost at the boss play. That's not where I want to go. Where am I? Oh god. Don't pull. Where am I? Oh, please. Thank you. I want to go back in. <laughs> There's the first one. Now, I thought the second... I get the uh, the first star coin and the second star coin mixed up in the stage. Because the first star coin is supposed to be the second star coin because it's further. But the second star coin is back in that door, so... It doesn't make sense. Apparently, it does. But whatever. Ah! I suck at this game. Alright, now it's time for the final section of this level where the third star coin and the boss is located. So, let's do this. These blocks make these things appear. Now, I'm gonna call them things. Do you guys feel offended? Okay. Oh god, time's running out. Yeah, when the time runs out, you just speed run as quick as you can, which actually makes it harder. So, just wall jump up there, get that, climb. Now, it's basically a tower where you climb. Are you serious? Oh crap, I moved the camera. This, yeah, it's still there. Yep. Alright, into the doors. I don't want to die because of the time limit. Here's Bowser Jr. You gotta be careful now because I'm tiny. There we go. And that is it for Nissan Marbro's DS Episode 3, or Part 3, whatever you want to call it. 
If you guys enjoyed, please don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. Helps out a ton, means lots to me. If you don't, I'll subscribe back too. I'll check out your content, and we can become YouTube babies. That's my little intro. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please remember to comment, like, subscribe. Helps out a ton, means lots to me. All your support is greatly appreciated. New videos every day. Next time on Nisha Murder's DS, we will uh, be doing the final half of World 2. Or should I say, Windy Sands. Until then, thanks again for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace, Nintendo Jaden. God, finally. Woo!